That's a huge swing from Alexandra Poletto. We've seen plenty of that today. Power at times. And finishing it off with a UCLA now up by one. And again, Hallgren just finding a way between the block and the pin. Another overhead dig. She can't do that. So she is definitely on fire for this pair. Tough serve. When we talk about fire, how about the heat from the back line? Well, that fits perfectly with what she's been doing. She's been hitting wrist away on that right side, hitting line, 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 line. She moves over to the left-hand side of the court and takes that same swing. They did both. She dove and the defender was there. Double up on defense for USC. Paletto's block has been so timely today especially in their matchup against LMU, and then again right here. The other thing she did, she was a little bit later that time, too. From Hallgren for the dual point, but a net violation. So USC finds their first dual point, and after the first flight, we're tied up at one apiece. Yeah, contact. And there's another crisp one in response from Abril Bustamante. Abril with an open net is a very scary thing. Just one. goes up fine. Situation, created that reserve. Big block from Graudina. Both teams hanging tough here in the second set. And again, Abril Bustamante with another big swing. Yeah, she's just so powerful on that right side. She, watch how quick she transitions back out there. Bruins up 2-1. Back to court one. Boy, Bustamante is crushing the ball. She is in rhythm today. Match point again. Bustamante, she's been swinging all day, and she does it again. 16 and 18, the number one crew from USC wins. So Bustamante and Gradina end up now with a 3-1 advantage over the McNamara's from last year and this year combined. It's all.